Euro continues to find buyers on dips. Before we start, a quick word from our sponsor. This video is brought to you by Exynets, the world's leading retail brokerage firm offering ultra-fast execution and no overnight fees. Look for a link in the description below. The Euro initially rallied during the trading session on Tuesday, pulled back, and then has rallied again. Ultimately, this is a market that I think is going to try to rise into the FOMC meeting on Wednesday, as we are anticipating that the... Federal Reserve will cut interest rates by 25 basis points, and now people are even pressuring them to do 50 basis points. At this point in time, it looks like that's what people are aiming for, bullying the Fed into cutting rates. And eventually they'll get what they want, but I don't think they'll get them in massive cuts. I think they'll get 25 basis points at a time, because quite frankly, if the Federal Reserve does cut quicker than that it could cause a bit of a panic at this point in time it looks like we are going to continue to see buyers on dips with the 1.12 level above being a potential short-term target underneath we have the 1.11 level as a potential support level and anything below there could open up a move down to the 1.1080 region all things being equal this is a market that is trying to go looking to the upside, but I don't know that we are going to continue to shoot straight up in the air. That being said, I also recognize that the volatility will probably continue, not necessarily abate. If you enjoyed the video, give me a thumbs up and subscribe.